One second. Hello? Yeah, um, let me call you back. I'm in an interview with GQ. What's up, GQ? This is Denzel Curry, and these are my essentials. First essential thing that I must present is this neutral bullet. Now see, most people don't know I like blending. I like mixing up drinks. I like making my own smoothies, my own juices and stuff like that, you know? My father showed me how to use a blender. He was like, hey man, I'm gonna make you a smoothie, but I'm guarantee you this is gonna knock you out. And I was like, no it's not. So, you know, I tasted it, not knowing there was alcohol inside it. Next thing you know, I'm watching Billy and Mandy and boom, knocked out cold, <laughs> sleep. This book is called One Punch Man. I read while I'm on tour, and I read this book a lot because it is funny. The main character is supposed to be unbeatable, right? And he's obviously unbeatable, which makes it funny. So the real focus is on the characters around One Punch Man and not exactly One Punch Man, but it still goes back to One Punch Man. Let's go with these shoes. Got these running shoes right here. You got workout shoes, and then you got shoes that, you know, when you go out, you're supposed to look good in them, right? So these are specifically meant for like running shoes. And I use these shoes to work out, jump rope, play basketball, play football, but majority just to run, trying to get, you know, the chi up, the exercise. I would like to get in this PlayStation 4. Be careful, be careful, be careful, be careful. Okay, there you go. PS4. A lot of memories. I had a PS1 back when I was a kid, and now the PS4. Here, I got games for this. Jump Force, which is basically like majority of all the anime characters in this one game fighting each other. Most people didn't like this game, but I like this game because I get to play it with my friends and fam and my girl. That's one. We have God of War 4. If you know about God of War, you know about Kratos, you know about him going against the Greek gods, Ares, Zeus. Here, this is Norse mythology, so you're going against Thor, you're going against Boulder, you're going against all these people that you see pretty much in like that Odin universe, you get what I'm saying? Or Norse mythology. Resident Evil. Creepy about Resident Evil was not to be creepy. Like zombies, that could exist, you know? If a zombie apocalypse happened right now, where would you go? The gun shop. Wrong. There's no food. You better get a gun already and go to the nearest food store and try to take over all the food stores. That's what I'll do. Soul Calibur. If you ever play Tekken, this should be easy. This should be second nature to you. But this deals with like swords, swordsmen. Me and my brother used to bump heads because of this game. This, Mortal Kombat, and Star Wars Revenge of the Sith. I would have had Grand Theft Auto here, but I left it at the house. And I would have had Mortal Kombat 11 here, but I left it at the house. I do not play online because I'm afraid of getting my ass whooped by you six-year-olds out there that just stay in the house and beat grown men's ass. So I do not play online. Oh, here we go. Now this is my North Face jacket. I have two of them. There is a yellow one that I always wear, and I was wearing it when I was on a taboo tour. It kept me warm, kept me cozy. The thing about this jacket is, it has a, like a lot of cool components to it. Like I have a backpack inside this jacket and whoever made this is a fucking genius. Excuse my French. And the design on it is amazing because it looks like a backpack, but it's also a jacket. And it has 3M. We shine some light on it and gleams, especially if you take a photo at night, boom, it really pops. I'm not really a fashion guy, but I love looking at cool stuff. Woo -woo! This is a pouch from Palace. I put my stuff in here. You wanna see what I have in here? I have my wallet, I have something to clean my goals, and I also have another set of golds. Sometimes I feel like regular teeth, sometimes I feel like just regular golds, and sometimes I feel like fangs. See what I'm talking about? The reason why I keep golds with me because it's a significant thing. Because being raised in Miami, Florida, Dade County, Broward County, West Palm Beach, we all wear golds. A lot of us got dreads. Some of us cut our dreads off. Some of us, you know, take our golds out. And most of us get permanents. I won't get permanents. Make your breath stink. That's why I keep a whole bunch of golds with me. Uno. Everybody know how much I play Uno, and it's a good pastime for anybody. I'm just saying, straight up, out of my mouth, y'all have some dumbass rules. Like, come on, you could put a draw four on a draw two. You just gonna expect me to draw two 
and not use a draw two on somebody else, and if they got another draw, it's gonna hit somebody else, that makes the game more funner. I'm not saying that you guys did a bad job, I'm just saying some of the rules could be a little better. Always keep a deck of Uno cards with you because you never know when you're about to be bored. Right here are my art books. Should be something like this. Did a self-portrait. And I drew a receptionist. If you think that's too childish and kiddish, I have a taste for sci-fi, science fiction. I also designed a bike. As an artist, I like Todd McFarlane, one, the guy who created One Punch Man and Mob Psycho, Akira Toriyama, who did Dragon Ball Z, H.R. Giger, who also did Species and Alien. Laptop, always essential, because this is where I do business. This is where I listen to music, because I'll be typing on here, I'll be creating stories. Sometimes I gotta email people, sometimes I gotta send tracks back, download. But also, I go on YouTube. YouTube is like my main go-to. Like, I love going on YouTube. I don't really subscribe anymore, you know? Back when I was a teenager, I used to watch this show called Epic Meal Time. It used to make me so hungry. And then one day we was like, yo, I wanna make a um, breakfast cake. And it was like, you would do something weird like that. And then the main person who was like, you would do something like that is the main one eating the cake. So I'm like, oh, okay. And that's how I learned how to like kind of cook, you know? Besides my mother and my brothers. Like I said, with the workout shoes. Gotta work out on tour, right? Pop this bad boy up on any door and you just get to lifting your own body weight. I ended up getting mad upper body strength. We was just using this pull up bar at every venue, just non stop, non stop. Every hotel, non stop, non stop. Calisthenics. I would recommend calisthenics. If you not into lifting heavy weights, just lift your own body weight. That's hard enough as it is. You know, just lifting yourself up, that's hard. Well, not for me. We have a Marshall speaker. Now, when you work out, whatever you're doing, if you're cleaning up your butts, cleaning up your house, or you just want to listen to music, this bad boy is gonna do the trick for you. Everybody needs music, everybody loves music. Even babies love music, like lullabies and stuff like that. It doesn't matter what brand it is. JBL, I like JBL, but I also like Marshall. It doesn't matter, they get the job done. I listen to music. Plus, I don't want them to be like, oh, he's pro Marshall, we can't sponsor him. Even Skull Candy, shop Skull Candy. Crock Pot! I'm gonna be totally honest. Yes, I bought a Crock Pot, but I don't know how to use it yet. But since we're going on tour and we're gonna be on a big ass bus, you need one of these things because you don't know when you're gonna get trapped in a city that you don't wanna be in. Get groceries, get some rice, get some chicken, get some fish, and you cook it in this bad boy right here. And then that way you don't have to pay for food, you're cooking the food yourself, and the only thing you're paying for is the groceries. And everybody on the bus is satisfied, we can eat like a family. Food brings a lot of people together because everybody's hungry. Well, that was it. This is Denzel Curry signing off with GQ, and these are my essentials. <laughs>